can you believe by using your hand fingers movement you can balance your right and left brain and boosting the brain power to get excellence in whatever field you're working in finger yoga involves movement of the hands and fingers that utilize sensory receptors on your fingers utilizing a structured movement of the finger and hands normally coupled with breathing has been proven to enhance and train the most overused but undertrained part of our body our brain our brains connects directly to the tips of our fingers so a stimulation of that area on our skin or utilizing our fingers for structured movement or self massage automatically trigger our brain so there are two parts of the brain right and left so for creative people tend to have a dominant right side brain while organized and disciplined people have a dominant left side brain it is completely possible for people with a dominant side to achieve balance by improving the other one so how does one achieve this so for this i'm going to show you finger yoga in this video so be with me and practice these finger exercises with me let's start first start joining your palms then start bending your finger side right side left side right side left side make sure your wrist joint doesn't move too much you're only moving your fingers now in the next one keeping your palms joined thumb facing upward direction and now start bending your thumbs right and left right and left now index finger now middle finger now try to do with the ring finger try not to move other fingers while you are using one particular finger now we are doing little finger the pinky finger now we'll do this movement which is showing here the thumb overlapping to each other now the index finger now middle and after this ring finger and now the little finger or the pinky finger you can repeat this 5 5 times now just join your palms like this where you changing your fingers keep doing this also 5 to 10 times now like this just try to join and hold for a while and now try to take your thumb up one at a time other thumb up now index finger other index finger middle finger middle finger ring finger ring finger little finger now we'll do and reverse little again finger. little finger pinky finger now and ring Back. finger ring finger middle finger middle finger and then index finger index finger thumb and the other hand thumb next we'll do the mind mudra we call it mind mudra also where you join all the tips now start rotating your thumb as shown in the video and reverse 10 times clockwise and anti clockwise you're doing now you will join it back and index finger you are doing 10 times clockwise then 10 times anti clockwise now middle finger 10 times clockwise 10 times anti clockwise now ring finger other all fingers are joined slowly slowly 
and we'll do anti clockwise after this 10 rounds now little finger after this again join them back keep this mudra for a while probably for 30 seconds this mudra is very effective I have already put a detailed video on the same mudra next just keep your palms or hands crossed interlock your fingers stretch in upward direction now in this position start raising your fingers one by one all fingers in sequence starting from the little finger ending to the thumb and then doing the reverse from thumb to the pinky finger or little finger you are doing one by one raising them up then you relax now once again we are going to repeat all of them this is the first one we did now the second one Now we will do the third one. Fourth one. Nicely press your fingers on your palm. Fifth one where you just hold. Sixth one where you just raise your fingers one by one next one mind mudra joining the tip of the fingers nicely and doing starting with the thumb clockwise and anti-clockwise movement 10 10 times
seconds again join them back keep this mudra for a while probably for 30 seconds now last one just cross your hands interlock your fingers stretch in upward direction then you will in the same position you will raise one one finger at a time 